Happy Tuesday guys and today is a special Tuesday because it's Shrove Tuesday which means not only is Lent starting tomorrow but also it's pancake day. Um, the boys are currently at school, I'm going to do some like standard crepe style pancakes later on in the evening for them. I've just done a photo for my Instagram and I've just made myself some red velvet pancakes and smothered it in strawberries and Joe and Seth's Prosecco caramel sauce. Cannot explain to you how amazing their caramel sauces are on pancakes, guys. Um, they very kindly sent me a ton over for pancake day. They sent me an orange and chocolate one, two salted caramel ones and their Prosecco caramel sauce as well, um, which is so good. Like, it tastes amazing. So yeah, I've just made myself a decadent little stack of red velvet pancakes, which I'm gonna show you now. So this is my stack of red velvet pancakes. I've just cut into it for an Instagram post. But oh my gosh, guys, when you add this caramel sauce, like... And these are actually unbelievably good value, guys. I'm gonna link them down below for you to check out because I know you're going to want them after this. <laughs> so yeah, that is my little pancake afternoon treat for myself while the kids are at school. When they get back, I will be filming me doing pancakes with them later on because that's always fun to watch. And you guys, hope you're having an amazing start to the week. Although you won't see this until Sunday, I'm still wishing it before time. <laughs> and yeah guys, I will see you in the afternoon for pancakes with the kids. Happy Tuesday evening! Um, it's Tuesday evening now, I'm just about to start making pancakes for the boys. Um, I've literally made my pancake batter earlier, it's one I made earlier. Um, I make my pancake batter with four large eggs, beat that up, mix in 200 grams of plain flour, mix that up, make sure it's like a thick paste and then add in 600 mils of milk gradually. And then like I just add like a spoon of oil as well <laughs> um, probably like a tablespoon um, but I'll leave that in the description just in case you guys want a recipe but if you want to see a full video on my pancake recipe then just let me know because I'll be more than happy to do that um, the main trick that I find with pancakes rolling my sleeves up getting ready into it the main trick is the amount of oil um, because a lot of people when they start doing them they're like oh the first pancake's always a write off only because it sucks up all the oil and it doesn't need a lot of oil so the first thing you can do is to reduce the amount of oil that you use in the first go and then you won't have to actually waste the first pancake either. The way I do this is oh, non-stick frying pan a treat that one's actually from Aldi and it's amazing um, what I do is I put my oil I use vegetable oil and I put it on a small plate like this and then I get some tissue right which sounds weird but bear with me <laughs> um, I've practiced this so many times I used to make so many pancakes guys it literally used to be a daily occurrence because Liam went through a stage where he only wanted pancakes um, I didn't obviously make him with sugar every single day for him but I used to make him like savoury pancakes and stuff for his lunch on like a daily basis so I got quite used to making pancakes so what you do is you dip the tissue in the oil and then we're just going to scoop it around the pan and that is it the pan's nice and greasy but it doesn't have too much oil on it um, but it's got just enough to cook the pancakes. Sorry, the lighting in here is going up and down and it's atrocious, but I can't deal with it. <laughs> um, but yeah, now I'm just going to put my pan on a low heat, I would say. And then we're just going to ladle one or two scoops of this, swirl it around the pan, and then flip it. And that is your sort of crepe style pancakes. Done, jobs are good. Let's see how this goes. <laughs> hey. Whoop whoop. Hey, first one's done. Perfect. Are you 
you haven't known USA, I'm going to keep it yet. Yeah, there you go. So that looks enough. I'm going to eat it. You want me to flip one? Yeah. Whoa! <laughs> Is that cool? How do you flip it? <laughs> Practice. Happy Thursday, guys. It's actually my mum's birthday today. Um, so we are just getting ready to head out. It's Thursday evening and we're just going out for dinner for my mum's birthday. So I thought I would take you guys along with us. I've got a nice little bag of presents down here to take to her. Um, so yeah, we're just popping to the harvester to celebrate my mum's birthday. And that's pretty much all we're doing today. <laughs> just, just, yeah, open that big one first. Oh. <laughs> it's from it's both of us. We oh, both yeah, we yeah, both came up with the ideas. It does. It's out of the cup of tea. I fell down the stairs. Tea is in the cup of tea. Open it nice and big. <laughs> Show the camera. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can't cope. <laughs> oh, <God>. Happy birthday! <laughs> Happy birthday, Nanny! He says you're going to get a new one each year as he ages. <laughs> Just go to open I can't remember what they are. This one's safe. Oh, yeah, yeah, that one's safe. Oh, let's go. Mm. I don't want a chocolate brownie with, with bacon. This box idea myself. Possibly. <laughs> I don't want it. It was a combination. <laughs> like I said, we it was a tag team on all your gifts. <laughs> oh, I like that. I'm gonna go to work with this. <laughs> Oh, look what I've got for my birthday. Mm. Do you like all your custom made gifts this year? <laughs> Did you read it? <laughs> oh, I love this. <laughs> <laughs> You're dumber than a box of rocks. Oh, I can't do it. You mean you would need me to finish it? <laughs> <laughs> Nachos to start with mm. and first trip to the salad bar. <laughs> you enjoying? <laughs> Fish and chips. Look at yours, yours is a beast. Looks so good. <laughs> Mel doesn't know how to pour a drink. <laughs> I was showing off. <laughs> Happy Friday, guys. I am currently having a girly night with my girl Mel. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the queen. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, so Mel's come over. Um, one of her kids is with her and he's asleep. Mighty boys are asleep. One's gone out with his friends to practice it's guitaring of some kind. And... <laughs> We like creepy <laughs> hand. <laughs> the creepy hand. <laughs> so we are just chilling. We're going to watch a fun movie, and we've ordered a buttload of Chinese food oh, because so much. yeah, we've ordered so much. We've ordered a lot, and you guys know how much I love a good takeaway. <laughs> <laughs> There's probably been a lot in the vlogs. <laughs> There's been so many takeaways recently, but yeah, guys, we've ordered a massive Chinese. Mm. We're gonna watch a movie and we're gonna chill, and that is what my Friday evening is gonna be it's consisted like the of. Best Friday ever, Absolutely. and I can't believe that you've got me in your vlog like this. <laughs> Let me know down below what you think of Mel's look. I think she looks beautiful. <laughs> I'm natural. <laughs> 
All right, guys, I'm going to show you when our food arrives because it's going to look amazing. But mostly we're just going to be chilling and chatting and watching a movie. So it's not really fun to vlog, but I thought I would just vlog to update you on what I'm doing in my week and to show you all our food. <laughs> our food just arrived. So we've got prawn crackers, sweet and sour sauce, sweet and sour chicken balls, um, prawn toast, chow mein, rice with gravy, um, chicken and black bean sauce, and crispy shredded chilli beef. Um, I'll show you once I've served it up. This is my dinner. And it looks so good. Oh. <laughs> We're now making brownies for pudding eating so much food i feel so ill but Ooh, it's bad it's bad <laughs> like i think i've gained a food baby food. <laughs> <laughs> so we are literally making some brownies and then we're gonna have this with some oh, joe and seth's caramel sauce with vanilla ice cream mm -hmm. is there a more perfect pudding no no i don't think there is no gooey brownies that are hot with ice cream it looks so good, look. Mm. Okay. Although, what do we do with this? Oh, it smells so good, it looks like oh. <laughs> You're so close! Oh. So close! <laughs> I think you threw it at me! <laughs> Just waiting for the brownies to cool down, and we've been browsing on TikTok, and we've been mm. trying to think of like TikTok duets to do this. So addictive. We've literally just got into a wormhole of TikTok. We've been sitting here for like 45 minutes. Just watching like TikTok. Like the film's paused. And we're just going through TikTok. for a while. Just going through TikTok. So we've done some as well. So definitely check out TikTok at It's Sammy Lou. Same like my Instagram and stuff, guys. Check out TikTok and you'll see Mel on there as well. <laughs> um, yes, yeah, so we're just trying to think of some TikToks to do. If you have any TikToks that you want me to recreate or recreate with Mel, leave them down. Don't count on me. <laughs> She's gonna do it. It's alright. She will. She'll do it. <laughs> right, we're gonna go back onto my phone, which I'm filming on, and watch some more TikToks. <laughs> wow, you can really dance. Wow, you can really dance. He went. He went. They said we've both been dancing all this time. What a coincidence! Okay, so these look a little bit sad, but. Prosecco caramel sauce, ice cream, and brownies. Warm, gooey brownies. That looks so. I tried to make it look for like an Instagram <laughs> photo, and it just was not working for me. <laughs> it, they look kind of sad, but they're gonna taste good. Oh. You know they are. Right, let's get these eaten. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 